Welcome back to another message from the beautiful Christed being in the Ascended Master Matrix, Sananda. Sananda is one of the four Kamara brothers who are projecting the purest energies of love to earth from Venus. These are beings of pure, loving, Christed consciousness, the pure love is called Christed. In this one, Sananda talks and shares and asks us to step into the shoes of the master builder. So let's get relaxed, maybe listen with headphones and listen with your heart. There are now many questions residing in your heart of hearts as this is a time of transition and transformation within the lives of so many. It is a time of transformation of the beloved planet. As you have all felt, there has been much healing, change and cleansing taking place within all the levels of creation upon and in the beloved terror, and many are witnessing great change within their own being. Much processing has been done on a cellular level within you all, has it not? Much letting go, much soul searching, you could say. Many are questioning the role that they have had to play. Many are questioning the life that they have chosen and the decisions they have made that have led them to this point in time. It is easy for us to say that time is just an illusion, as in the higher octaves of light, there are no restrictions of time. Many of the light workers in their meditations have been asking for great guidance, have been asking for clarity and wisdom to know what is correct for them. What choice is the right one? This one was given the invitation which I extend to you now to step into the shoes of the Master Builder, for that is truly what you all are. If you understood the illusion of time, you would understand that in your divine blueprint, you hold the key to all your answers to the now, future, and past timelines. And while for some here, there is an element of clearing to be done of past issues, it is also a time to assess the plans of the future that you hold within you. Only you can do so. You pray for guidance and you ask to be given what you need to fulfill that which you have come to do. Yet you do so forgetting that you all hold that you need within you. The web of one runs through all, and it holds within it all the keys, all the codes, and all the secrets that are yours to know as you tune into this web via your breath in each moment. Although the be here now reality is important, you must also understand that you as a collective are driving the direction of your future by your combined energy emissions. These emissions can be changed and hence you can change the direction of your evolution. You have understood that your thinking creates your experiences on this plane and that your life as it is now has occurred through your thoughts, your words, your actions and your choices. The future is a result of your now moment focus. You each lay the groundwork for your future, for this new world you seek, and for the beauty and perfection that you wish to create in your lives by accessing the blueprint within, for within you are the perfect codes for perfect co-creation. When you sit in your meditations, I ask you to begin to build according to the vision that you access. These visions are the visions of higher mind, of divine purpose, and you will know them by the spontaneous release of joy within your heart when you see them, sense them. 
So begin to fantasize. Let your imagination, your desires and your vision flow freely, motivated by pure intention for the highest good. The vision that sparks the most joy within your heart is the one that you must follow, that is right for you, as it is your soul talking and communicating to you. Many acknowledge now that you are the creators of this new heaven here on earth and that you alone will bring in the dawning of this new age. You alone will construct this new age and you will do so in unity by assessing, accessing your own unique purpose and role. It is a creation that will occur through the unification of all the light workers amongst humanity at this time. Yet before there can be true unification, there must also be acceptance of each other's choices, for you all have such unique roles to play. All of your choices are valid, for all your experiences are there to teach you, to inspire you to connect with your God essence, to tune to the higher consciousness that sustains you and all beings on this planet. You will find that the messages you receive as you open up to your inner guidance, though unique, will allow you all to hold a piece of the jigsaw puzzle that will allow this new age to be created. So open up your antennas to unity. Ask that the beings of perfect resonance that you can work with, be inspired by, be brought to you. Realize that regardless of the labels, we are all motivated by a common goal. Regardless of the roles chosen, the motivation is also directed by higher purpose, by an unseen hand, you could say, that is directing the play of life for humanity at this time, to allow all the creatures upon this plane to experience their full potential and to understand that you are all the sparks of the divine expressed uniquely. The transformation that you all seek will happen only through your desire for it to take place. It will happen according to your vision, which is like a video movie stored in the database of your divine blueprint. This blueprint is encoded on a cellular level within each and every one of you, awaiting both recognition and for you to press the play button. We can inspire you, but we cannot do the work for you. You alone are the master builders of your domain, but the blueprint has been written before embodiment for you to access in divine timing, and so it will be. All is a circle. Your journey is a circle. From whence you began, you will return. So your lesson at this time is to learn to work together, to go within and be the oneness so that you may break through the tide of mass consciousness and create this golden age. Recognize the God within so that you may see the God within all your brothers and sisters regardless of their path, regardless of their awareness, regardless of their expression of being. The master is within all, hiding in the shadows the sum, so to speak, but it is for each individual to find the light switch and illuminate their own realms. So, as you are all aware, your earth mission is simply to step into the oneness of your being, to experience the expression of God and the creative force in every moment, in every life form, and in the being there will be great doing. Spend time to create this golden age, to bring forth the vision of how you wish for this planet to express her creatures, her plant life, her mineral kingdom, and her human life wave. And when you are clear in your vision of this beautiful age, so it will be created. End message.